it's day two. You could say day three. Um, I'm gonna count the first day of day zero, so this is day two. I've done 14 miles of the trail so far. I've just woken up, had a coffee. Um, I've just had a little look at the map and I'm gonna get to uh, the old man of store this morning, uh, today. That's gonna be my mission. As soon as I'm past the old man of store, then that's the hardest part of the trail over and done with. So it's about six o'clock in the morning. Uh, I've just had me coffee. I'm camped right underneath these cliffs to get out of the wind. Um, so let's have a little look at the map and I'll show you my route for the day. Okay, so this is where I camped last night in this little nook under the cliff, out of the wind. If you get to this point, the wind is savage, then I recommend the only way to get down is here. But you get to just before you start heading up to the next summit, uh, scooch down here. It's quite easy to get down. It's quite flat once you get there and then hook, uh, hook your way into here and it's really far out of the wind. So a good little spot. So now what I'm going to do is pack up camp and then I'm going to head back up here, scooch up here. It shouldn't be too difficult. Um, it started to rain a little bit, but it's the midges that I've got to avoid, so it uh, should be all right. So once I'm up here, it's just a case of carrying along the ridge line all the way down. Loads of ups and downs, loads of ups and downs onto section B of the map. And yeah, you just keep going along this uppy downy ridge line all the way. If we keep following it down, we should get to the old man of store. So that's going to be my mission for the day. But I'm on mile 14 now, um, roughly another 10 today. Loads of elevation gain, lots of scenery. And then I think what I'm going to do is probably camp by the store loch stand, which should be a good spot. And then once you're past that, uh, you just got to get down to Potri, which is down here. So that would be a good little resupply spot. Uh, I've got enough main meals, but it's... Uh, little snacks and things that I could do with picking up. So yeah, old man of store today. That's the plan. The weather's meant to be diabolical today, so I don't know how much filming I'm going to have the chance to do, but I'll do my best. Um, old man of store will be the highlight.
sat here kind of enjoying the view for a little bit and yeah this whole way up here was incredible just walking down that looking at all this but there was um, a couple of peaks prior to this this one here um, I ended up going down the wrong way because you're following the contour of one of the tops but it's easy to just follow that and uh, forget that you're supposed to be following the cliff edge so I ended up having to backtrack about five minutes because I went about, I don't know, half a mile, quarter of a mile too far and now I'm here so I've just got this ginormous up now, a down and up and then I'm at the old banner store and that's the hardest part of the trail done feeling good legs are good um, feet are wet but no blisters I don't know how these seal skins are doing today I think they got wet inside last night because I left them outside the tent and it rained so my feet are just wet now but that's me here you go there's needle rock I've just hiked through some of the worst wind and rain to get here old man of store is down there somewhere so I'm just gonna keep going I won't be able to get much good film done from this today there you go, look at that man oh man <laughs> so terrible get the drone up get some sick footage well the old man of store is up there and I've made it to the road there, so I'm going to um, maybe go into those trees to get out of the rain a little bit. So I've uh, just crossed the reservoir, had a little something to eat in those trees and like I'm on my way to Putri now like nine miles from here now so I'm just gonna keep going ah <laughs> oh, this weather this weather has literally chewed me up and spat me out I don't know why they call this sky trail there is no trail at all just bog 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 look up there yeah that's where the old man of store is and I just woo, way down there over here now I'm walking through god knows what but it looks like it's starting to clear up a little bit there's dirt on my hands strong like a tree there's roots where I stand oh I've been running from the law last up for the day the last trick point and the last epic view oh, I'm absolutely cream cracked wow there's a uh, potri down there over there there's the old man's store where I was a few hours ago. This is all the bog. Mid central, look at this, just look at it. Magic, magic, magic. 
you can see the Cullen shrouded in cloud there, just between my trekking poles. Be there either tomorrow or the next day. I'm so glad the weather cleared up. Now I've managed to dry out a bit. That was the uh, one of the hardest, toughest sections of trail I've ever hiked. I didn't need to take any compass bearings, but I was kind of in the mood to do it. But yeah, Woo. big day. All right, now down to Portree. I'm gonna go get a beer. <laughs> Oh